Hey everybody, this is Erica off the Classy Climb blog. I apologize in advance. My nice shade curtain fell down and so the sun's giving me crazy angles. So, but uh, on a serious tip, I just had to say, uh, I've been noticing on the news, I just realized, man, we got 11 more months. 11 more months until we have a new president. And I know everybody's like, no, no political, Erica. I'm not, I'm not going political. I'm just doing this really quick uh, tip for everybody who is a black or Latino conservative on TV. You're very popular right now because we have a black liberal Democrat president, right? And so they're calling you and they want you on TV and they want you, you know, doing shows. They're like excited to have you on, but guess what? In about 11 months, that'll all be over. I'm so sorry. It really, really, really will be. So I'll try to get out of the light a little bit there. It'll be over, right? And so what I'm trying to convince people to do is I hope you're building a list. I hope you're building an amazing email list. I hope you're putting together books you can sell right now. I'm hoping the next 11 months is the most prosperous months for you of your whole life. Why? Because once Obama's out of there, I don't really see where they're going to have you on TV. I see a bunch of people getting fired. I see a bunch of people not being called to be speaking on anything, on any issue. And I feel bad for them because they've done a great job. They've been a voice that has been ignored for a long time. Um, Black Tea Party members, all these people in these different states who are showing that conservative people in different um, classes and groups and minorities are conservative too. But with that being said is the new economy hits you just like everybody else. Supply, demand, all those good things. So what your total focus should be at this point is an email list, a book you can sell, a bunch of speaking engagements this year, and a way, a way for you to extend that somehow in the future. I really hope and suggest you go on speaking tours for the next five years, <laughs> depending on who wins this election, right? And so I I just can see the writing on the wall. There are people like Tom Joyner who is losing his radio station um, position at the end of uh, twenty at end of Obama's uh, presidency. Why? Because this guy has been this voice in the dark. Um, this guy has been the voice on the radio for maybe twelve million African Americans and been able to help people raise millions of dollars for HBCUs. He's been able to sell books. He's been able to go on tours. He's been able to do a lot. Same is said for Steve Harvey. And so, um, you know, it's the change of the times, you know, as this, you know, this first African-American president goes out, a lot of people, their voice, they're no longer going to be necessary to be seen on TV or heard. And so I just really, really suggest you build those email lists. I suggest you uh, build up those references and you build up that speaking tour you want to do because, wow gonna be crazy dude it's gonna be so crazy so but uh this is erica classy climb blog your you hear your actions you know you have 11 months make the best of it get the most speaking tours write the most books uh put out products or whatever else you can sell in services go to cpac go crazy uh because it's pretty much over after that <laughs> this is erica classic climb blog you guys have a great day